welcome to Scribe's Delight. This is a demonstration of how to use our smoke-free, unbreakable sealing wax. It comes in cylinder form, like this. We have a wide variety of colors, and we can also make custom colors to match any swatch that you have. Here's how to get started. First, you take your heat gun applicator and attach the metal stand that comes in every package. It locks right in here, and it goes on both sides. And what it does is very important. It keeps your heat gun applicator upright on the work surface. Never lay your, hand, your heat out gun applicator down on its side. Very important. Okay, once that happens, then you take your sealing wax. We've already placed one cylinder in. You take a second cylinder and push that in. And you get them lined up because you need two cylinders to get started. And you plug in your heat gun applicator and warm it up setting it on the low setting. Once you have that started, we have it heated up, and here's the set we have here. You never want to start right away on your correspondence. You'd like to start on a practice sheet. And some people even make their wax seals on a sheet of wax paper and then glue them onto the envelope to make sure they look great. So we've started some sealing wax here. Uh, as, if you press your gun and it doesn't quite go down far enough, you push the wax from the back like so with your finger and if it's gone down too far where you cannot reach the sealing wax you can take a chopstick or a pencil or any uh, long wooden piece and push it down further and we're going to make a nice shape here a nice large seal here and then we're going to take the seal and drop it right into the wax you know some people like them round I like mine irregular and here comes some more, so we're going to do another seal over here. And we will do a smaller seal. And this one is a swirl. Okay. And a third seal that I'd like to show you how to do is on the ribbons. So if you have a, want to do it classic sealing wax look and put it on ribbons, you can do it like that. Okay, so we're going to let both of those cool, and I'm going to put it on my work paper right over here, and let that stand there, and then I'm going to put another seal right here into that. This is a 17th century E, and you just let them cool for about 30 to 60 seconds, okay? Now the ribbons are a lovely touch, and you can get those in all different colors and we have them here at Scribes Delight. I have one that has just come out. It's a 13th century Italian eye and has that lovely white vine scroll. Here's our swirl. And you know that it's ready to come out if your seal will lift off easily. Never force it. Okay? And another thing that I'd like to show you before we close is in some of the old books you have the illuminated letters. And you can illuminate your seal with any pigment ink, and we do carry the pigment inks here at Scribes Delight, and that gives it a beautiful, beautiful, elegant look, and each one's a little bit different. I have found that when we've sent things with seals on them, people tend to keep them forever and frame them. Why don't we do that with this E a little bit here? 